Hi, Itsy here. I'm taking a break from my campaign trail for a little while, but we did want to talk about some things. Remember our little poster that we had? How to build community? Well, how to build a nation, one community at a time. The first, the first item on my agenda is turn off your TV. I know it's hard, isn't it? We're pretty addicted to our TVs for sure. I guess you have to ask yourself, after you're done watching the news or whatever you're watching, do you feel better for it? Does the news get you upset? Does it get you fired up? Is that what you want in your life? Every evening or every morning before work? Is that a good way to start your day? I mean, maybe it is good to know what's going on in your world. And I, I went for many years without cable and I didn't watch TV at all. And I did kind of feel out of the loop at times, like when I, I'd go to work and people would talk about Survivor or Dancing with the Stars or whatever was going on at the time. And I always felt kind of like I had nothing to, <laughs> nothing to say because I didn't really know who these people were or what was going on. But I'll tell you, I didn't feel like I was missing anything because I felt like my life is pretty fulfilled. I take my time reading books that I enjoy and, and learning new things and in many ways I didn't feel like I was missing anything. Though there were times I did feel like I didn't know what was going on with the news or, or anything like that. So yeah, there is definitely a side to it where if you want to have conversations about those kind of things, you, you want to be in the know. But the truth is I've surrounded myself with a bunch of people who really, we don't talk about news. And I mean, once in a while we talk about things that are important. I mean, being president's really important to me. So, you know, that's important. I want people to know about what's going on there. <laughs> so I want you to watch my channel and, and help me out here. But, <laughs> but seriously, all kidding aside, it would be really nice to first, I guess, take the time and find out how much time you're really spending watching TV. So, when you first sit down in front of the TV and plop yourself down with your, your food or your popcorn or whatever you do when you watch TV, notice what time it is. And then when you're done and it's the, the evening's over or whatever's going on and you turn that TV off, look at the clock again and ask yourself, how much time am I spending watching TV? You know, once in a while I'll get in front of it and it'll be four and five hours and I just think, well... What did I get out of that? You know, four and five hours and nothing, really. For the most part, a lot of times I got nothing out of it. But when I read a book that's interesting to me and I sit there for two hours and read a book, I close the book and I think, wow, that was really interesting or I learned something or I could better myself in some kind of way. So think about how you spend your time because it's really important to know for yourself how you're spending your time, what you're doing with your life. You know, and, and our next thing that we're going to talk about is get outside. That's the next part of my agenda is getting outside. And we'll, we'll definitely talk about that too. So think about how much time you're spending watching TV. Ask yourself, is it worth it to spend this much time watching TV? Am I, is it interesting? I mean, sometimes you could get some laughs from TV for sure. I mean, there's some funny shows that no, no doubt about it. They, they make you laugh sometimes a nice uh, belly laugh and all that. But the truth is you could find that with your friends. You could find that with, with real life, with your own life. <laughs> Just start, start somewhere, man. Call some friends and say, let's have a dinner together. Let's do some raw foods. Let's, let's have a raw foods dinner or let's have a big smoothie night or let's have a, a juice party. I mean, Dan McDonald, he has parties with every kind of fruit he has. And that's kind of cool. And, and you could start doing those kind of things with your life and eat some healthy foods, get together with your friends and have a good time. Turn off the TV, not the YouTube, because you're learning something. The TV. Thanks. I'll see you again, and next we'll be talking about leave your house. Take care. See you again. Bye.